all my future ghosts. I'm Nat and or Maggie and or you can full name me with Nat Maggie. I go by she, her pronouns. And today I want to turn myself into a Tim Burton character. Now I thought about this plan about five minutes ago. Well, probably a half hour now because I have to get like all my makeup. But I decided I really want to do it. And once I decide something, I do it. So we're going to do that. Now I am not good at makeup. I've never been good at makeup. I try my best, but I'm really scared that I'm just going to end up looking like I have two black eyes and just dirt on my face. But here's the thing. I got new foundation recently and it's definitely not my skin tone. It is too dark and a different tone, but we're going to use it because it's all I have. <laughs> I'm gonna first moisturize my lips because I always moisturize my lips first. I will put a primer on just because I find foundation goes smoother with a primer and I have two primers. So I use one for the majority of my face. And it just goes on so smoothly. I got a little Tatcha sample, I think. I got it from something. And I do that one under my eye. I don't know why I do it this way. I just, it's what I do. So I go under and then on top of my eyes with this. And I also, because I can get dry nose, put it here, here, sides of my mouth, and then forehead. I, I don't, I can't tell you why. It's just, it's what I do. I have been doing it. I'm not gonna change that now. So now let's get into the foundation. I have no rhyme or reason with this. I just pat it. So my foundation is done, which now means I have to do the hard part. So I have some reference photos on my side here. <sighs> now here's the thing. I think I have pretty big eyes that I don't need to do like the secondary eye. Cause like people oftentimes will put white and then like another part of their eye to make their eyes bigger. But I don't feel like I need that. I think it's gonna be like outlining my lips a little more than I want. Make them more of like that shape. Darkness, just like here and like under. Leave a little bit of white. And then my eyebrows are pretty tiny. And then just like pale. Normally I do have a, I do have like a contour, but it's a really light shade. So, and it also is hitting pink. Heavy in here. Okay. Like, do you see that like heavy? I'm feeling really confident right now after that. And I feel like that confidence is just going to disappear any second. Once I start doing more than what I've just done. Yep. It's already disappearing. <laughs> oh no. Okay. I feel like I want to do. I have to small, make my nose smaller. Their noses are tiny, so like, maybe if I can make it into more of a button. I don't have the tiniest nose around. Like they have the smallest little button. So I'm gonna try to do that. I'm gonna try to emulate that, but with contour. <laughs> I can already see this going terribly wrong. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Everything is fine. It's fine. I mean, worst case scenario, this never goes out online. <laughs> oh no. Oh, what have I done? I don't think that was the look I was going for. I feel like I just made my nose bigger. Are you ever like really confident in something and then as soon as you start doing it, you realize that maybe this wasn't the best idea? I like your confidence wasn't justified. You know, is that is that like just me? Or yeah, just me? Okay, okay, cool. This is not going good. <laughs> I just want to be a Tim Burton character. I want to want to look cute. I see some girls on TikTok, some women who like look like Tim Burton characters. Some of them like sing 
and they're beautiful and their voices are just so lovely and I just want to be like them. It looks like I got punched in the face. You just got to keep doing it, you know? Okay, I'm just going to I'm going to keep going for it. I'm going to keep going for it. Does it always look bad and then it gets better? heard that your makeup looks worse before it looks better and I gotta do one of these because I'm not a thin lady but thin ladies they well at least Tim Burton characters their chins are like <laughs> gotta make my chin look like that <laughs> Have I given up yet? I think I might have. I think I might have just found my give up point. Okay, what if I just get <laughs> I'm just giving myself a five o'clock shadow. No big deal. No big deal. Oh my goodness. No big deal. Omitted. This is going to be his breaking point. <laughs> I had ghosts in my hair. So if anybody's on my TikTok, you would have seen that a couple days ago, I dressed up as a ghost. But I had like a ghost shirt, I had ghost earrings, and I put ghosts in my hair. And he came into the bedroom and didn't even acknowledge. Like he, it was so normal. He just like talked to me like normal. And I got really like, <laughs> he's like, what? And he thought I did something. He was like, he was suspicious. Like, well, what, what did you do? So he went to like my makeup counter where I was sitting. It was like, what's over here? What are you doing? And I was like, you just didn't acknowledge my look. Like you, we're just so used to the bullshitness of me that you were not phased. I feel like this time he's gonna be phased. Listen, if he's not phased by this, I've made it. <laughs> I don't know why I'm going in with the eye again. I'm just making it worse. Some, some people do so good with this. And I feel like I'm not those some people. Is putting purples into this going to be a disaster? Will that just look more like I'm going for the bruise look? I'm not. I'm just trying to... I don't know what I'm trying to do anymore. I don't. I can't. I I feel a little... Dis I think I've just turned myself into a... Oh, into somebody who needs help. Actually, no, no, no. Shush, 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 shush. shush. This might be... This might be better. <laughs> this is, it doesn't work. I really, like, a half hour ago, I was like, I can do it. I, can, I didn't watch a single tutorial. I didn't really look it up. I just said, yep. I think I can do it. I think I can do this. What are our thoughts? What are our opinions? <laughs> How we feeling? I'm trying to minimize it. I don't know why I'm closing my eye. I like close my eye so I can like see it better. It's not good. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what to do. Should I have gone for a more subtle, like realistic look? Yeah, probably. Did I? No. No, I did not. I don't worry. I did I didn't. I don't think this video is gonna see the light of day. Just gonna put powder. Cause that's all I have in the inner corner of my inner corner in the waterline. I'll deal with the repercussions later. Oh, oh okay, or now, or now. I have very dry tear ducts, so this is a bad idea. I think it's gonna work, right? 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 Do we see the vision yet? I don't. <laughs> My eyes are dry. Come up, powder. 
I'm like, I think I want to put... I want to close off this eye a bit. So it's only light up here. Okay. I'm gonna put a primer on. Because I really want my eyelashes to like go for it. And now I've learned the secret to this. Is you don't let it get dry. Because if you let it get dry, your eyelashes will not like work with you. I need my eyelashes to like live their best lives. Like falsy look, you know? Cause I don't I don't wear false eyelashes because I have eyelashes that are very long. But if you want to get like the false look, you gotta just do multiple layers. So it like thickens them. It does shorten them when you do that. I will say like if you if you do the multiple layer it will shorten your lashes but will thicken them. And that's what we're going for. So you have the top done. I just get my eyelashes done before other things I find I don't I can't see the look until the eyelashes are done. So I want to get those. I don't know really don't put a primer on the bottom, but I mean today's the day we're trying it out. We're going for a clump. The best part of this is if you actually get black on the other parts of your skin, like you're already putting purples and stuff. It doesn't really show. I don't think this is doing what I want it to. I'm gonna do my eyebrows. Just wanna get them done, if I'm being honest. I don't like eyebrows. I I don't know how to do eyebrows. They stress me out. They don't work like I wish I was one of those people that could do my eyebrows nicely, but I mean, honestly, I'm not. I don't have that skill set. I don't I don't know how to draw on eyebrows. I don't know how to fix eyebrows. I just hope for the best every single time. And every time it's a gamble on whether or not they look good. And it's usually, the odds are like 10% for the good, you know? They're never, they're never good. In certain characters, their eyebrows are like tiny. I feel like my eyebrows, my natural eyebrows are good enough. I feel like this side did better than that side. Do I make it deeper? Maybe. Cause I feel like their eyes might look, mine might look bigger if I make it like a deeper circle. Is this gonna ruin it though? One way to find out, right? I think, yeah. Or is my too much sheen coming out? Cause I do have one. I am all about too much. Okay, growing up, I was told I was too much. Um, I put too much everything on everything. If you've seen any of my pride looks on my Instagram, you'll see what I mean. The first day of pride, I came out the gate screaming. Um, it wasn't good. <laughs> it wasn't good at all. I feel like I'm just never going to be happy with this look. <laughs> I feel like I didn't do what I was out here to accomplish. And that it's not going to ever be what I want. I'm a little eyelash for and don't put too much makeup. Now it doesn't look good when the too much change shows. Yell it out. Say, don't come here. We don't want you. Okay. So now I want some like, I think red. Cause they tend to have like pretty red lips. So I think like a, oh, I don't have the perfect color and that makes me sad. I'm gonna do a lip stain first. It's an orangey color though, I will say. Cause remember, I learned the colors that work for me. And I threw away most of my stuff because it was either expired or filled with gluten, which I'm gonna say some, I'm really gambling with these lipsticks today because I don't know. There were some that I didn't know if had gluten or not and as a celiac, doing this for you. I think I'm gonna go for like a full lip. I'm just gonna with like my natural shape, but like fuller. I do have a cupid's bow. 
I will say though, I'm so jealous of people who don't have a Cupid's bow. I think that's the prettiest, like when it's flat across. Oh, I don't get how people overline here. Like even if I put like down here, you still can't see it. I have like here, okay. Look how far down it is. Like, hello? Anyway, I'm gonna erase that with foundation. I just want to let you know my struggle. Because people overline their bottom lip and I don't know how they do it. How do you do it? I mean, wait, it's not bad. Right? Like, it's not, it's not good. All my makeup friends, because I, I have friends who do makeup, are gonna be like, yo, Maggie. You should have just called us. And I'll be like, I wanna try it myself. Okay, this might be my new look. Maybe I do this every day. You know, it, it, I won't, it like uses barely any makeup. It takes two seconds. I feel like my nose is just too big and that's fine. I, I do like my nose. I will say I do like my nose. It is the nose of my dad and my mom combined and I will never get rid of it because I absolutely adore it. But for Tim Burton, my nose sucks. I have this purple and this will ruin it. Don't worry, I'll ruin it right now. Purple ruins every look I ever try. And yet I'm still doing it. I feel like it works. Should I have half up half down my hair maybe did i do it do i look like a tim burton character or have i just been working so long on this that i think i do don't answer that <laughs> that's all i have for you today happy halloween i hope it's a good one let me know in the comments what you went as i am so excited to hear what everyone dressed up as and maybe get some ideas for next year because like i said this was very last minute this was a 10 minute ago decision um and by 10 minutes now it's been a, it's been a while because i i just did it but what do you think do you think it looks like a tim burton character here i can come up close to you what do we think how do i do does it look like a tim burton character or no you can say no <laughs> okay i'm gonna phone some friends and see if i can get their reaction to this look and see what they think here's the thing i did this on the sunday before halloween at 6 p.m my time which means everybody in my time zone is out partying right now because party day or are in the uk going to bed so first i'm gonna call amy aka silly bean she's one of my bestest friends i absolutely adore her she loves all things horror she is truly just on huge huge knowledge of horror and makes everything really fun so i'm gonna call her first and get her um <laughs> i just saw myself again in the mirror i'll get her opinion uh and honestly i'm very nervous <laughs> it's not good she's gonna be so nice to me she's gonna be so nice to me she's gonna be too nice to me she's gonna hype me up in ways that she shouldn't <laughs> oh no it looks bad on camera <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I tried to make myself into a Tim Burton character. Oh, I like it. My nose looks really funny. <laughs> That's okay. It's Tim Burton. You're supposed to look funny. That's true. Does it does it look Tim Burton-y or have I spent an hour doing makeup and can no longer tell a difference anymore? I literally said Amy's gonna be so nice to me. <laughs> I, didn't, well, I haven't seen that many Tim Burton stuff or that many Tim Burton things in my life, so I don't know if it would be funny to me. I know I've seen them, but I haven't like rewatched them as much as I have other stuff. Okay. And so Okay, I can I can work with that. Does it look stupid? Be be so honest with me. Does it look stupid? Yes. Um, I don't think it looks stupid. I just I think I just see you differently because you always have like your glasses on and stuff. But That's so true. When you look at it, what do you think? I know you've said that you've been staring at it. 
I've been staring at it forever. I feel like, I feel like here's the thing, being a Tim Burton character and being bigger is harder because you don't already have the chiseled face, you know? Like you don't, like you have to chisel out your face. Like here, this means glasses, but they're so dirty. And it, Tim Burton doesn't work with glasses. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like had I used the purples and like browns I did for my eyes and just a normal contour, you know, right. and like yeah. I think I think the eyes are fine because like that's kind of what he is, is like you want the full. I feel like that would have been better, you know. I feel like you'd also, it would, it would um, translate so well on a stage. I, I agree with what you've done, like to just emphasize everything else because it does look good mm -hmm. on Oh, thank you. Thank you. But I think it's fun. <laughs> I don't think there's any right or wrong way to do Halloween makeup. Like, as long as you do something and it captures what you thought it was going to capture, then, like... True. You're good, and it's all good. It doesn't, it doesn't need to be a certain way or another. Because it's Halloween. You can do whatever you want. Yeah, it's so true. It looks, it's super fun. It looks good. Thank you. I'm calling my mom, and I'm getting her reaction. So, here we go. Hello. Hello. <laughs> what, what do you, you what do you think? One second. One second. One second. One second. One second. I like it. You like it? Does I it do. Okay, so I went for Tim Burton character. Does it give you that? So that's like Nightmare Before Christmas, Corpse Bride, that kind of stuff. It's very corpsey ish. That works. It works. It does. Yeah, you like it? I do like it. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure. I've been doing the I've been filming for like an hour and I just kept adding and at a certain point I was like, I don't know if I like it because it's it, I've just been staring at it for a long time. You could even go further with it if you like. How so? Well, like your eyes are bigger and you're like, "Oh, I like that." Oh, like here more. Like that. Yeah. No, yeah, I thought about that. Mm, that's fair. That's very fair. Thank you so much for, for doing this. I appreciate it. Love you. Bye. Okay, I don't know if I got all that on video because um, it did, my recording stopped. She, I was going to call her. She called me. Um, but that was really sweet of her. She's currently at one of my auntie's uh, birthday parties. So she stopped what she was doing, found a room where nobody was, just to call me to react to this video. We love Mama Maggie. Please give a shout out to Mama Maggie. She is the best character in this entire world. I agree. But that's all I have for you today. If you'd like to see more of my face, I do game over on twitch.tv slash natmaggie every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday at 1 p.m. Eastern. We are playing Oxenfree DVD. Um, we play some Disney Dreamlight Valley. We like anything cozy and scary. That's kind of our vibe over there. Besides that, if you like to give this video a like, I'd like that. And if you like to subscribe to see more content from me, then I wouldn't be opposed. <laughs> but I do have some other videos for Halloween. If you'd like to see those, I do have a playlist that I made specifically about the Halloween content. And I'll be here. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.